Uh, good afternoon, everybody. I'm here at my wife and I's grape farm that we bought. Well, when I say farm, it's just a vineyard. That's all it is. It's no farm yet. I have my work truck here. The ladder and the aluminum brake hanging out the back. There's four acres of grapes on this property and another acre of field. The family's tractor. I need to build the barn out here. So that's a fact. So there's a hill in the background and we're halfway down the hill. And then in the distance over there, you can see Lake Erie and across the lake is Canada. This is our campsite. We've removed three rows of grapes. We bought the property because of the awesome view looking at Lake Erie. And goal is to build a house here in the future. But right now we're trying our best to maintain the grapes. They are a new challenge for me. I've never really thought or gotten into any kind of farming or gardening of any sort really. So it's all trial by fire so to speak. I didn't realize planting these cherry trees that the deer would kill them. So I had to put fences up around them. The neighbor's house over there. It's snowing out. If you look here, you can see all the deer tracks. One, two, three. Six, six cherry trees. I'm hoping that they do good. These are all the grapes. I do my best to maintain the property. It's been quite a challenge, but hoping that I can make long-lasting improvements to it. It's all grapes, so there's no shade on the property, which is one of the reasons why I planted these cherry trees. It's a slow, slow process though. The neighbors to the west, which is what direction we're facing now, were a little angry about us using the right of way. So that was another reason why we removed three rows of grapes. We made our own made our own driveway onto the property, which is where my truck was parked. So now we don't have to argue with those neighbors ever again. Not that I ever really argued with them. It was, it was their uh, protest. But yeah, uh, I'll keep you updated on this. Have a good day.